drainage when inoculating with NA. Once you've pipetted the larva onto the bandage, they should be applied to a convex, hairless area of skin. But where exactly? Well, you want to be careful putting it too close to your armpits or groin area because that could cause the lymph nodes to swell, but other than that, it's pretty much up to you. The go-to place seems to be the inner bicep just because it's convenient and easy to reach, but there's no reason you can't put it anywhere else. Personally, I did my first inoculation on my inner bicep, the second I did on the lower arm of the opposite side, the third I did on the outer shin, the fourth I did on my stomach, and the fifth I just did yesterday on the top of my foot. Also keep in mind that if the inoculation is successful, it's very likely that it's going to itch, so you want to put it someplace that's not going to be too awkward to scratch or too inconvenient to reach. A few comments from others have been, I put mine on the arch of my foot. Isn't that where we would pick them up in the natural environment? I didn't have any histamine reaction, no bumps, no itching. I like to do ankles. I did inside my ankle so I could scratch with the other foot. I put them somewhere that isn't hard to scratch. Down on my calf, I'd be bent over all day long. It always itches badly, but say the most sensitive places such as inner lower arm and inner calf, not to mention the hollow of the knee, are a 10 on the itching scale then the middle of the thigh, or slightly above the knee, is seven or eight. Inner thigh, a few inches above my knee. I did my second dose on my thigh, and that worked fine. I use somewhere on my legs because it's easier to hide under clothes. I always get an awfully itchy itch, but slightly less when using the upper parts of the leg. Top of the upper leg is best for me, less visible. Since it's summer, I think I'm going for left thigh or hip this time. I always do my stomach. I've done my thigh, but prefer my arm, as the itch seems more manageable. I always use the place on my inner arm halfway between my elbow and wrist because it's flat and smooth. The forearm can easily be covered with a light sleeve, but also quickly accessed for airing out or changing dressing. I prefer the inner left forearm because I'm right-handed and this makes applying anti-itch cream easier. I did two on my thigh, then switched to my arm. I found that the closer to my armpit, the faster it heals, and generally my arms heal faster than my legs. I started inoculating on my shoulder because I sleep on my side and that part is always squished against or rubbing around on the bed and plus not very sensitive, so the itch is quite bearable. And one last word of caution, the intensity of the skin reaction tends to increase over the course of the first few inoculations, and inoculating in the same spot will also cause a more intense reaction. Personally, I don't have any preference, I just inoculate in a completely different area every time, but if you find that you prefer your arm, for example, just try not to put it in the exact same spot on the arm every time. You can find all of this information on the wiki page Helmet Inoculation under Body Sites Used for Hookworm Inoculation. And happy itching!